can't hang out on the beach without freezing Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas times We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Doesn't matter if the snow is falling Welcome back to my channel. Today we will be decorating for Christmas. Oh, I'm so excited. I can't believe this time is already here. Like I don't know where summer went, where fall went, how we're into November. But anyways, today we will, I know I have stuff everywhere. Today we will get started on the main floor. Um, I have four trees to put up. I'm gonna start by putting the tree up. I feel like that just like sets the mood. I just downloaded um, a Christmas Audible book. It's called Christmas Cupcake Murder. Now normally I don't do like the murder type books, but I thought, you know what, it has good ratings. I'm gonna pop my AirPods in and listen to that while I decorate. Um, so anyways, for those of you that are new, my name is Megan. I am a nurse, I work straight nights. I have a five-year-old daughter named Harper and a almost three-year-old daughter named Oakley. They're just upstairs with their daddy, my husband Addison, hanging out up there while I get started down here. They'll probably bop in and out during this. I'm wearing a Christmas shirt. Merry Christmas, you filthy animal. I got this on Amazon for anybody that is curious. This is an extra large. Um, that's how I like my clothing. So anyways, enough chit chat, let's get into it. Well, I'm all for Christmas. All the happy smiles and the wishes. And I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe. you're missing I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow whatever we do we will be all right these holiday wonders so you're gonna see Santa's little elf bopping in and out here trying to help me Oakley was so eager to help me hang ornaments on the tree which was fine I just had to kind of pick them off eventually um, due to the magic of filming and editing, you guys will not see this, but see the bottom lights that are on the tree there? Yeah, all of the other lights on the tree died. Um, I tried all the different plugs, like you'll see me looking around the tree trying to find the plugs. I tried everything. I could not get the rest of the tree to light up. So I had to leave, stop filming, go out to Canadian Tire and buy four new boxes of Christmas lights and then just put those on the tree instead. Whatever we do, we will be all right. These holiday wonders will open your mind. May all your wishes tonight come true. The love I live, the dream I knew. Well, I'm all for Christmas. It's a magical time full of kisses. Take a walk outside and tickle the snowman's nose. Moving nimbly. Did you hear something from the chimney? I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow. So I'm going to divide this video into a two part decorate with me. Today we're just going to do the main floor and then in the next video I'll do the loft and the bedrooms. 
but you'll notice a common theme with me I love to hang these beaded garlands on honestly I think I did almost all of the trees it looks sloppy when you're starting and it can be difficult but you just fiddle with it and play with it when it's all complete and I adore the way beaded garland looks on the tree I also have this little trick where you just cut chunks of ribbon any kind of ribbon that you like whatever your color is or your theme you're just going to cut it into like little however big you like eight inch sections one foot sections and you just tuck that into the tree to mimic like a ribbon effect and it, it looks great like i said you just have to like kind of fiddle with everything but it always turns out amazing I'm also going to point out um, I do so right now you'll see me just putting on a whole bunch of different like silver and pink type uh, Christmas tree balls I did find all of our personal ones downstairs every year I go to the mall and I have a personal ornament made up with all of our names on it with the year and I hang those on the tree I just I didn't have them with me for filming right now but I found them later on that day and added all of those to the tree as well So next I'm just going to move on to the fireplace mantle. I don't know why I'm being so awkward here because eventually I'm going to take everything down and give the fireplace mantle a good wipe before I move on. Um, I thought I was just going to add the big thick Christmas garland and leave that but I still thought that it looked a little too bland. So I went back and added in that eucalyptus uh, garland that I'm taking down right now and I just did like a double layer and then I was much much happier with it. And then uh, following this, I'm gonna put the stockings on. Oh my word, you guys, these are the most beautiful things ever. The cream colored stockings I got on Amazon and the name tags I got off Etsy. And there's just something about it to me. It, it's so silly, but it's like a dream come true having these stockings with our names on it. <laughs>
So now that I am like beyond thrilled with the Christmas tree and the fireplace mantle, I am just going to move on throughout the rest of the main floor. Um, this is just the main living room above our couch. It doesn't take me very long to do these kinds of shelves. Like I have a general idea of what I like, what I want. I throw things up. If it looks good, I leave it. Uh, sometimes I'll go back later and fiddle with it, but it's not like I have, you know, like a ton of like, items that will fit in certain places so you kind of just like get what you get and if it fits that's it <laughs> So an affordable way to fill up any space you might have is to just use these bottle brush trees. You can find them at Dollarama or a lot of them I got on clearance um, a couple years ago in a kit with something else. And I just use them, place them around in any empty spaces throughout the house and it is a really affordable way to fill some space. Never have I ever added a holiday rug or mat into the kitchen and I've got to say I'm obsessed with it. I found these Disney mats at Costco. Um, they were kind of a little bit pricey but I guess not really for Disney. They were $29.99 each and I got one for the kitchen and one for the girls bathroom and I absolutely love it. That little pop of color and how soft they are, totally worth it.
I'm not gonna do too much in our dining room here. Um, just this table runner I love. I got it a couple years ago at, I think, HomeSense. And then I'm just gonna put my chargers and plates back out. I did find some holiday red chargers at the dollar store. So I'm just gonna use those. I did have the little, I don't even know what you call them, like the little picks for above on top of the napkins, but I couldn't find them for this. So, oh well, I'll get something for the top later. But Oakley's birthday party is basically in a few days and I'm gonna have to rip this table apart anyways. Um, these deer are beautiful. They were a gift actually to Addison a few years ago, but um, yeah, hello, I'll use them. They are beautiful, they're so sparkly. So I'm just gonna leave them on top of the table here and call it a day. Let's go get snow. Christmas tree, glimmering light, I am right where I want to be, I'll be home for a couple of days, wander around with you, you and me in the cold, thought it'd never be true, wherever I go I got you, oh I have stopped running, there is no way trying, you better loosen your belt. Drinking hot wine by the fire Don't care of anything else It's Christmas And some kind of love, my friend I pray it will never end Do you like to be here too? It's Christmas And outside snow's glistening just you and me tonight I'll spend all this Christmas with you Oh, it's such a charm Got you up in my arm There's nobody at the door You said I wish this will never be over Darling, it's time for your present Come over here Now it is time to get out in the snow so obviously I decided to put my skinny tree beside my hutch this year. Uh, we've only been in this house for two Christmases now and last year it was in the loft, but we have an exercise bike now where we put that tree last year. So it'll go there and that's fine. I like it there. I can see it when I'm on the main floor and that's where I keep the Halloween tree as well. So now on to my Ray Dunn hutch, one of my favorite parts of the holidays. Um, I'm just gonna offload everything, see what I've got, and um, I'm just gonna like kind of speed through most of this for you guys and um, get this hutch all decorated. It's Christmas, and outside snow's glistening. It's just you and me tonight. It's just you and me tonight. It's just you and me tonight. Christmas with you Hold up I am on my way I'm in motion Let's go to the ocean Yeah let's go outside We can hang out on the beach with our free isn't that amazing in Christmas times? We'll 
So once I have all my pieces where I want, I'm just going to plug in some extras. I have a couple like extra of those bottle trees, some homemade um, like mug toppers, like the fake looking whipped cream, uh, the snow, that fake snow you just get at the Dollarama or the Dollarama, the dollar store. Uh, I use it year after year. I just save it when I pack everything up. And then that little snowflake garland up above, I got that at the dollar store as well for Oakley's first birthday party. And again, it's just something that I reuse every year. So it's all done. I'm just gonna wipe down the hutch, give you guys an overview. And that is it for today's video. The main floor is decorated. Now, like I said, I will have a part two coming soon that includes the loft and the bedrooms. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I would love it if you could give this video a like and subscribe if this is your kind of thing and stick around. I would love to have you guys. Thank you so much for watching and have a good day, everyone. Santa's gonna come and join us in this song hey!